hello everyone welcome back to the channel in this video i will discuss about the ev model that is going to launch soon the all new honda activa electric in this video i will clear all the doubts from the pricing and the launching date of this model so let's start the video <laughs> The Honda Activa has been one of the most trusted and popular scooters in India for over two decades. Honda has a reputation for building reliable, low-maintenance vehicles and with the upcoming Activa Electric, they are aiming to bring those same values into electric specifications. Plus, with the Indian government pushing for greater alternatives and offering subsidies under schemes like FEM2 that will give electric scooters becoming more economical and sustainable option towards in the future. We expect the Activa Electric to keep a design similar to the petrol version. Well, the Activa is popular for its simplicity, its easy to handle body and its practicality. You can expect some updates like LED headlamps for better visibility, a digital instrument cluster that shows all the information like speed, battery level and storage, maybe some new color options that will give eco-friendly vibe. The Activa Electric is expected to come with a lithium-ion battery pack. These are same types of battery used in other high-performance electric scooters and electric cars. They are efficient, they charge faster and they last longer than the older lead-acid batteries. As for the range, we are looking at around 100 to 150 kilometers on a single charge, which is pretty solid for daily commuting in the city. Now, what about the motor? Honda is likely to go with brushless DC motor that is basically BLDC motor which is both powerful and efficient. We can expect a power output of around 3 to 5 kilowatt that will give you smooth acceleration and enough power to handle city traffic with a easy. The top speed will probably be in the 60 to 70 km per hour range which is perfect for R1 riding. One feature that Honda is likely to include is removable battery. Charging the battery could be 0 to 100 percent is expected to take around 4 to 6 hours with a standard home charger. However, there may be a first charging option available that will allow you to charge you 80% less than an hour. Like the most other electric scooters today, the Activa Electric is expected to come with a fully digital instrument cluster. This will display everything you need from the speedometer and odometer to your battery percentage and the estimated range left. There's also good chance Honda will add smart connectivity features. Another expected feature is riding modes, probably an eco mode for extending battery life, a normal mode for everyday use and maybe a smart mode for those times when you need a bit more power. And lastly, regenerative braking will be likely a part of this package. The Activa Electric is expected to be priced around 1 lakh to 1 lakh 15,000 exorum. Yes, that's a bit more than the petrol power Activa, but when you consider the lower cost of charging versus filling up on petrol, plus the fact that you don't need that as much maintenance with an electric motor, the higher upfront price can make this sense. The price also puts it in the same range as its computers like the Ather. 450X, Ola S1 and the TVS iQ. So Honda is definitely aiming to competitive while still offer the reliable and trustable Activa brand carries. So this is the video for now. What is your thought on this model? Please mention that on the comment box below. Until next time, be safe, ride safe.